Welcome everyone, I would like to show you how to fix on your Xbox Series S where you're playing a game and then all of a sudden you're kicked out of the game, it crashes and you get an error which says out of video memory. So the reason why this happens is two reasons. First of all, the game isn't properly optimized and number two, quick resume. So in order to deal with the quick resume issue on the Xbox controller itself, just click on the button and then navigate to my games and apps and you see a quick resume. If you see any games or apps which are here, you want to click on start and then you see here remove and quick resume just click into this one like so and remove any apps which are inside of quick resume so it seemed like it didn't want to remove itself there we go so it took two attempts and now any games which are here will be removed so the games in the quick resume they use extra memory and these game developers sometimes will not compensate for the fact that games are in quick resume so the game developers, they'll use up all the memory on the Xbox Series S, even though that there's a part uh, specified for Quick Resume. And that means that if you're playing the games and you have apps or games in Quick Resume, it will crash them. Now, if you don't have apps or games inside of Quick Resume and you're still getting the crashing issues, that is because the game developers are you uh, haven't really pop uh, properly optimized the game for your Xbox Series S. So if that is the case, there's nothing you can actually do on your ends if you would like to just try something out for the sake of trying stuff out, uh, the best way is a power cycle. So a power cycle is on the Xbox Series S itself. You just want to unplug the back power cable, wait 30 seconds, plug it back in, turn back on the Xbox Series S and see if that solves the issue. If it doesn't, there is quite literally nothing you can do. It's an issue with the game uh, itself. So you just want to, you know, report the issue on any Reddit or any forum where the game dev uh, devs will be able to see the issue. And in the future update, it will be fixed. So again, it's not, not to do with the Xbox Series S console. It's not to do with the software. It's to do with the game and quick resume. So with that being said, thanks for watching. See you guys later. Bye-bye.